Hello, my dear friends. Welcome back to Infigyan. In this video, we have one very, very interesting and challenging exponential equation which we are going to solve for the real values of x. So let's get started. I will write x cannot be equal to negative 2. Denominators cannot be 0. Let's write our equation 16 power 1 over x plus 2 plus 8 power x plus 5 over 3 is common from this denominator. So I can write x plus 2 in the bracket minus 4 power x plus 3 over 2 is common here. I will write 2 common out in the bracket x plus 2 minus 2 raised to the power 2 over x plus 2 equal to 120. Now we know the exponent law a power b times c can be written as a power b whole power c. Let's apply 16 power 1 over x plus 2 as it is plus 8 power 1 over 3 and then we will put power x plus 5 over x plus 2 minus 4 power half and then we will write power x plus 3 over x plus 2 minus 2 power 2 whole power will be 1 over x plus 2. RHS is 1, 2, 0. Now 8 power 1 over 3 is 2. 4 power 1 over 2 is 2. 2 power 2 is 4. So I can write 16 power 1 over x plus 2 plus 2 power x plus 5 over x plus 2 minus 2 power x plus 3 over x plus 2 minus 4 power 1 over x plus 2 equals to 120. Now I will split x plus 5 and x plus 3. So I can write our equation. Let me write here once. So I will write 6 plus 2 plus 2 raised to the power x plus 5 over x plus 2. Now I will split x plus 5 and x plus 3. 16 power 1 over x plus 2 plus 2 power x plus 2 plus 3 is x plus 5 over x plus 2 minus 2 power x plus 2 plus 1 over x plus 2 minus 4 power 1 over x plus 2 equals to 120. Now I can write 16 power 1 over x plus 2 plus 2 power x plus 2 over x plus 2. So I will get 1 plus 3 over x plus 2 minus 2 power x plus 2 over x plus 2 is 1, 1 over x plus 2. Then we will write minus 4 power 1 over x plus 2 equals to 120. Now a power b plus c, we can write a power b times a power c. So I will write here 16 power 1 over x plus 2 plus 2 times 2 raised to the power 3 over x plus 2 minus 2 power 1 is 2. So 2 times 2 power 1 over x plus 2 then minus 4 raised to the power 1 over x plus 2 equals to 120. Now we can write 16 as 2 power 4 
and 4 as 2 power 2. So I will write our equation 2 power 4 whole power 1 over x plus 2. Then I will write plus 2 times this is 2 power 3 whole power 1 over x plus 2. Then I will write minus 2 times 2 power 1 over x plus 2. And last 4 we can write this is 2 power 1 over x plus 2 and then whole power 2 equals to 120. Now I will switch these two parts using exponent property a power b whole power c equals to a power c whole power b. So I can write our equation as 2 power 1 over x plus 2 whole power 4 plus 2 times 2 power 1 over x plus 2 whole cube and then I will write minus 2 times 2 power 1 over x plus 2 then I will be writing minus 2 raised to the power 1 over x plus 2 and then whole square right hand side is 120 now I will consider substitution let us say 2 raised to the power 1 over x plus 2 equals to a. For real x, a must be positive. So we will get equation in a. a power 4 plus 2 times, this is a, a cube minus 2 times, again a minus a square equals to 120. So we are getting one quartic equation. Let me write equation here. a power 4 plus 2a cube minus a square minus 2a equals to 120. I will use method of factorization. I will write a power 4 plus 2a cube. Then this minus a square can be written as, I will write plus a square, so I need to write minus 2a square. In total it is minus a square, minus 2a equals to 120. Now from first three terms, I can write this is perfect a square of a square plus a. minus 2 is common from last two terms we will get in the bracket a square plus a right hand side is 120 now i will consider a square plus a equal to m once a is positive m must be positive so we will get equation in m as m square minus 2m equals to 120. Now I will add 1 to both sides. Plus 1, plus 1. Now LHS is 1 perfect square. This is m minus 1 whole square. RHS is 121 which is a square of 11. Now we will consider a square root both sides. m minus 1 will be equal to plus minus 11. By adding 1 to both sides, we will get m equals to 1 plus minus 11. So I can get two values, 1 plus 11 and 1 minus 11. This is 12 and this is minus 10. Condition on m was m must be positive. 
so we will reject minus 10. So accepted value of m would be m equal to 12. Now m was our substitution a square plus a. So I will write here a square plus a equal to 12 or I can write a square plus a minus 12 equals to 0. Now I will use quadratic formula. So I will be writing a square plus a minus 12 equal to 0. a will be equal to as per formula minus b plus minus the square root of b square minus 4ac over 2 times a. As per our equation a is 1, b is 1, c is negative 12. We will get a equals to minus 1 plus minus the square root of b square is 1 square, I am writing 1, minus 4 times 1 times negative 12 over 2 times 1. So I can write minus 1 plus minus the square root 1 plus 48. I am writing the square root 49 over 2. So square root 49 is 7 minus 1 plus minus 7 over 2. So with plus sign we will get 7 minus 1 over 2. So I can write 6 over 2 is 3. Minus 1 minus 7 is minus 8 over 2 minus 4. So here we have two values of a also. a equal to 3 and negative 4. For real x a must be positive. This was condition on a. On this ground I will reject minus 4. So a will be 3 only. Now a was our substitution. a was 2 raised to the power 1 over x plus 2 equals to 3. Now I will raise power x plus 2 both sides. So a power b whole power c, I can write 2 power 1 over x plus 2 times x plus 2. So these two brackets will be over in LHS, RHS will be 3 power x plus 2. So I will write our equation 3 power x plus 2 equals to 2. Now I will consider log both sides. So I will write log 3 power x plus 2 equal to log 2. Log a power b is b log a. So I will write x plus 2 log 3 equal to log 2. Now divide both sides by log 3. We will get x plus 2 equal to log 2 over log 3 which will be written as log 2 base 3. Let me write here x plus 2 equals to log 2 base 3. Now subtract 2 from both the sides we will get x equal to negative 2 plus log 2 base 3. Now I can write minus 2 as I will write minus log 9 base 3. This is negative 2 plus log 2 base 3. Now log a minus log b is log a over b. So I can write here this is log 2 over 9 base 3. So this is our final answer. In terms of decimal, if I will write 
value will come out negative 1.369 approximate value. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck.